simply go to the Restream Live Studio, click onto the RTMP button below your preview, copy paste both the RTMP URL as well as stream key into OBS and after a short moment your live stream should appear as a source in the Restream Live Studio. This video is brought to you by Restream. Learn more about how Restream and the Restream Live Studio can help you reach more people online by checking out Restream with the link in the video description down below. Hi, I'm Greeny for Greenbox and in today's video I will show you how you can combine OBS with the Restream Live Studio. If you're watching my live streams, you now know that I'm using the Restream Live Studios for all my live streams, but the layout we are usually streaming isn't exactly default. Instead, it's this what you see here right now. And the way I do this, I'm using OBS to stream directly into the Restream Live Studio to then use all the Restream Live Studio features to go live for every one of you on YouTube, Twitch and wherever I want to go live. To achieve this there are two different methods so let's start with the first one. For the first method we simply have to go into the Restream Live Studio and in the Restream Live Studio we're using a feature called Studio Pull. And to set this up we simply click onto the RTMP button below the preview and in here Restream is giving us an RTMP URL as well as a stream key. We now have to copy those two entries into OBS as if we would stream to any other service. We go to the settings, go to stream and enter the custom URL as well as the custom streaming key. Please note that every time you want to go live with the Restream Live Studio, you have to do this again because every single session using the Restream Live Studio generates a new streaming URL as well as streaming key. Once the settings are in, simply save the settings and hit go live. And after a short moment, inside the Restream Live Studio, there will be a new source and we can simply enable this source and we now have the source coming from OBS directly in our Restream Live Studio. You might be wondering right now why I would stream to the Restream Live Studio instead of just going live directly from OBS. And the answer is quite simple because I can use all the great features of the Restream Live Studio like inviting guests by sharing a link, displaying chat messages on the stream by clicking on it or using custom captions when I want to do that. So it's super simple and easy to do it in the Restream Live Studio and this is why I am doing it. The only thing is this very easy and straightforward method is only available to upgraded premium accounts of the Restream Live Studio. If you're a free user you have to do it with a different method and I'm just about to show you how you can do the same thing in the free tier of the Restream Live Studio. So we are back in Streamlabs OBS where I have set up all my scenes with my custom custom design and when we want to enable the virtual webcam we simply go to settings and then go to virtual webcam and say start virtual webcam. If you're using OBS Studio instead you will find the virtual webcam under your controls with a button named start virtual camera. Back inside the Restream Live Studio we now have to go to the settings and in the settings we have to change the video input from our webcam to the Streamlabs OBS Virtual Webcam or the OBS Studio Virtual Webcam. In my case, Streamlabs, so I'm using this one. And from now on, when we enable our webcam, we will see the scene we currently have selected in OBS. However, there is one thing we now need to address as well because currently we are only receiving the video, not the audio. So if you want to have more than just your microphone audio, in your stream, for example, you also want to have your system audio because you're playing a game or you're having someone on Discord or something like that. We need to account for that and to do that we're using Voice Meter Banana. In case you have no prior experience with Voice Meter, I highly recommend you watch my earlier video about Voice Meter up there. This should give you a rough idea how Voice Meter works. So what we now have to do is we have to set up the audio routing that we're not only sending our microphone audio to the Restream Live Studio but also our system audio. In my case I am using the first virtual output as the output which is going to the Restream Live Studio. And what we now have to do is we have to ensure that our microphone audio as well as our system audio is going to that first virtual output. So our first virtual output corresponds to the B1 output. So our microphone, which is over here, sends its audio to B1 as well as our system audio, which is over here, sends its audio to B1 as well. And when B1 is ticked, 
the microphone as well as the system audio is going to the Restream Live Studio as long as we set up the audio input inside the Restream Live Studio to be our first voice meter output number one, which is this one. So from now on, when I enable my webcam as well as my microphone, the Restream Live Studio will receive the video from OBS as well as the audio from my microphone as well as the system audio thanks to voice meter. Again, if you only want to have your regular audio without the system audio, you can simply change the Restream Live Studio's input to your microphone. So no need for voice meter, but if you want to have a fancy setup with your system audio as you would have when you would stream to the Restream Live Studio directly from OBS, you have to use voice meter or a similar software tool to accomplish this. All right, and this is how I do my advanced setup when I go live with the Restream Live Studio. I really hope this video helped. In case it did, please let me know by liking this video. And if you have questions about the Restream Live Studio or how I did things in the video, feel free to write a comment. I am Greeny, this is Greenbox, and I will hopefully see you in yet another video, which is now here on the end card. So feel free to click one of those videos and I will see you there. Goodbye.